the marijuana brings. Number one, it brings uh, what we're talking about really is the experience that it could lead to. And if you could lead to other drugs, it's going to lead you to criminal behavior. It's going to lead you to marijuana has a tendency after you after you smoke it, you get lazy, you get relaxed, it relaxes you. So for somebody who's on a path to education and wanting to further their education, you need to be energized. You need to be ready to get up and study. You need to do research. You need to focus on your education. And that takes energy and it takes you to be alert and awake. And marijuana has the opposite effect on you. It puts you to sleep. So therefore, number one, it's going to take away from your studies. It's going to take away from you achieving your goal. If you want to go to college, if you want a better job, if you're trying to increase your ability to be more marketable in today's society, it, it's a challenge because you, you're doing something that takes you in reverse of what you really want to accomplish. It pushes you back. It doesn't push you forward. And so anytime you put any chemicals in your body, that's going to change the way you think, the way you feel, the way you perceive things. Because if you notice, if a person comes in and says, I want to go to college, and you start smoking marijuana or alcohol, start drinking alcohol, or start running around with a certain group of people, or if something really unhealthy happens in your life, then all of a sudden you say, well, I don't want to do that no more. And you ask the question, well, what, what happened? Oh, nothing happened. I just don't want to do it anymore. 